Thank you so much, guys. Indeed, if you can call them that, Castinga. Well, first off, I'm very happy that you chose to stay here in Europe, Raymond. Um, <laughs> <laughs> let me ask you about this game versus Fnatic. Of course, you guys had a rough start yesterday, and especially about your drafting. Fnatic came out with the exact same team comp as yesterday. How much of that was anticipated, and how did you guys prepare for that? Well, initially, yesterday, like, we were really... <clears throat> We kind of got out drafted because we picked champions that one we didn't really practice for a while, like one with Lulu. Like we didn't really play the comp to, like to the correct standard. We picked Tristana, who needs like four items to do something, to 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 even do anything in the game. So this game or today's game, we came in like with another draft that we can actually benefit from it rather than like uh, I can't say for, uh, uh, <laughs> kind of um, like be creative. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It, it basically, we we picked a better draft that makes us. Uh, flourish as a team, and it kind of showed today that against Fnatic they'll still be able to. So I mean, clearly you expected the the poppy rotation. We haven't seen Misfortune or Morgana really in yesterday's games. Uh, maybe could you talk a little bit through uh, that laning phase because you know MF got hit by the patch. Morgana, uh, you know, isn't a support we've seen too much. Why why this set of laning laners in uh, this game for you guys? Uh, well, actually, like we've played two v two against some other teams I and mean, scrims and stuff, and then we played around with Poppy and Lucian, etc. Like all the OP picks right now, and I feel like after playing against most of the uh, current support, like Fresh and stuff, that are also meant to be really good. I just found out like Morgana can actually be really good against Poppy too, and you saw in lane phase like we just have to survive, and then once we're level six, especially you just have a Morgana Q, MF ulti on top. Like MF ulti is still really really strong, and people underestimate that part of her rather than just focus on her E. So yeah, I'm picking like MF, I think she's still a strong pick. Were you surprised that it went back to the 2v2 lanes or did you successfully mind game Fnatic? No, we actually wanted the 2v2. Yeah, like we obviously did. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like we initially thought like uh, we, Poppy would be, uh, sorry, how did I say it? We thought she, she was just baiting when she went over the ward. But then she actually wasn't baiting. And yeah, I mean, they, they swapped into us, which is what we wanted. So it was working out overall for us. Yeah, that was great. And when you guys had a lead, you pushed it through. And that's something that we've seen from most of the games here so far. Why do you think it is that almost all of the games we've seen so far have been one team getting an advantage and then just being able to push it incredibly hard onto a win? Uh, I think that's to do with like the current meta or the picks as well. Like Mid is just control mages mainly. And then after the AD carries are really, really strong now. Like they, They're really easy to push like lanes with. And one, <coughs> I think the, the minions changes. Like They actually made... Uh, the minions push much faster. Like we noticed, like we can actually siege like one tower really, really fast, especially the first one. And yeah, I think overall this patch we're slowly adapting to it. So in the future, it'll be better. Still seems that a lot of teams are adapting, but you know, you guys are a new team. I just want to get your thoughts internally. What are the expectations for Vitality for this split and the whole season? Uh, for this split, I'm like I'm not gonna be uh, really optimistic or saying yeah we're gonna get first or something because that's not my goal. I think our goal as a team is just we want to improve and make sure that we make it like we want to be able to perform like maybe how we did today, but at least in playoffs, like top six. I don't think looking to like for number one in spring split is too much of a, a accomplishment. Well, good thing to set your sights on. Thank you very much and congratulations, Kasing and Vitality with a win over Fnatic. And as we speak, H2K is gearing up to face Origin in our next game. We'll take a look at the two contenders when we return. But first, we'll hear from Origin's newest mid laner who's got some big shoes to fill.